Good day vloggers, how's it going? Just finished doing the uh, the video for Stacked. I guess it's my Christmas special video. I didn't know I was doing it until last night. I'm like, well, I gotta be in Alliston uh, for an appointment. And while I'm here, let's just look around since we got Rusty back in, back into the swing of things. Uh, let's just let's look around and see what's around. And uh, looked at all the fast food places, looked at all the restaurants, went through a few menus. And Stacked had these uh, amazing things on the menu. Uh, the first one was the the waffle, sorry, the um, vanilla apple pie French toast, which is, was okay. But the gingerbread waffles were phenomenal. And I hope you've seen that video and uh, get the shout outs at the end for you guys for being amazing supporters. Uh, somebody sent me an email. I got, oh, it's just, I've ordered some stuff on Amazon, so I'm getting the confirmations. But again, when you do uh, sweet things like this for breakfast, having a black coffee definitely helps take that sweetness off your, your tongue. I used to be a heavy believer in um, orange juice for breakfast and milk for breakfast. Never drank coffee before. Or, and then when I started drinking coffee, it was the double-double, two sugars, two creams. And... Uh, but I'm glad I've gone to black coffee now, especially when you're eating sweet breakfast like this. Not that I eat breakfast anymore, but this is a special occasion. And these napkins they gave me, look at them. They're like really thick and big, as opposed to these really tiny uh, fast food ones. So we'll put that into our special reservoir of backup supplies. But uh, they gave me too, too many syrups. So uh, I'm gonna take them home. I don't think we'll use them, but I take stuff like that home, all the extra stuff, and then Carol can make the final decision. And uh, yeah, I think each of these things, it would, it would have been nice to eat it in there, but they, they only are, uh, can accept like 53 people in there at a time because of the, um, the restrictions out there, that there, that's this Omni, thing for COVID is, is happening and it's kind of slowly taken off and uh, they're doing all the restrictions and I think the Tickle Toad has been affected again with the whole no drinking after no you can't sell alcohol after nine and I think I think last call is I think it's the last call is nine and they have to be closed by ten or I don't know exactly all the rules but yeah it's gonna affect all these restaurants but it was uh, as full, legally as full as they could be. And uh, I, I did a take up because of course I'm gonna eat in Rusty. And, uh, but I would like to start eating in restaurants. So it'd be a lot of fun. But now this, what's this, the fourth wave of COVID and the variants and all that stuff. I'm just gonna swear. Yeah, but it's so, as you guys are as fed up as I am about all this crap. So one of the things we have to buy for Ben and it is uh, compressed air. He wants one of the, for, we've already bought him a bunch of uh, Christmas presents, but one of the things he did request was like canned air and uh, just to help clean out his computer and stuff. So he lives in an apartment and uh, it doesn't have like a compressor or anything. I got all my cutaway shots already. There's been multiple times in the past when you, when you see a video on my channel and there's no cutaway shots of like the speaker and the, the menu and all that stuff, the menu board, when you don't see that in a video, a food video of mine, that means uh, I was in a rush to get out of there. I shot the video and then I started making a vlog like I'm doing now and then, uh, and then I forgot to do my cutaway shots and then I, I get home and I'm like, oh man. And there've been times where I've not gotten home and went back, but got maybe five, 10 minutes away from the restaurant and said, no, I, I need to get those shots and actually went back and got the shots. So off to my left here is the big Canadian tire store. Let's go shopping. One last sip, there's a little bit left.
that's it. But they're really expensive. You can get like two or three cans for, it says it's $14.99. But it says it's a duster. I'll get one just in case. I can't get any more. But uh, maybe I'll try a computer store. All done. Got a few extra little things for stocking stuffers and stuff. Even got some of those temptation treats for the cats. And uh, they love those things. Make them do tricks. All right, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do next. I guess I gotta get home and start editing this video. I want it to be up tomorrow, just before Christmas. Just remembered we need to spend Rough Bumps LCBO card. Might as well get our booze today as opposed to Christmas Eve or something and the lineups are crazy huge. So today is Monday morning or sorry, Monday afternoon, it's 12. And uh, it would be in my best interest to buy my alcohol now and then I don't have to do any lineups. There are quite a few people going in. There's no lineup to get in, which I believe that will be on Christmas, Christmas Eve, there'll be lineups. So let's find a parking spot and we'll go. section. It's all right. Some of these bottles are gorgeous. Island of Fiji. That's, that's good rum too. Another one of my favorites. Appleton Estate, beautiful. Havana Club. So under much deliberation, I think I've decided to go with this Appleton Master Blend. Here in Canada, it's 4645. Ref Bump, thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you and your family. I'm all stocked up for the season. I am all done here in Alliston. The very cold town of Alliston. I have my jacket, but it's such a pain in the butt wearing a jacket all the time. I miss, there we go, maybe that'll help. The problem with the iPhone flipped camera facing towards me, it doesn't like, uh, too much contrast of light. The uh, van seems to be driving well. No issues. Took me a couple minutes to figure out how to <laughs> use the, the windshield wiper spray because it's so, it's so different from my car. I think mine's even on this side. So this is on this side and you have to actually push the lever in towards the steering wheel column. Whereas mine, I think it's just a turn or a twist or a pull. I think if you pull this lever, it does high beams, which kind of probably pissed the guy off that was in front of me when I was trying to figure out how to spray my windshield. This is a really pretty town. They got a lot of really old Victorian style houses. See that? Probably better if I get away from it. If I touch that right there, there. Oh, that's better. Much better. 
but uh, yeah, I've always thought about living in this area just because of how pretty it is. And I like our area too, but house is too small. Mary Brown's right across the street from a Dairy Queen. You see, you can't get any better than that. They rebuilt this Dairy Queen. I don't think I've done a review here yet. It's right beside a vet. Awkward. Actually, that would be good, eh? You bring your, your pet in to get his teeth done or check up or whatever, and you just zip over to Dairy Queen. Grab yourself an ice cream while you're waiting. All right, let's go home and say hi to the cats. Thank you.